What's up, Mies, Nebraska? Oklahoma Community Watch. West. Good morning. I believe in Kim Lemon. G Mop Ham. Hi, Jane. Bikes is there, I think. What's up, Sasha? Thanks, Jane. <laughs> I found pikes. Thirty dollar, thirty dollars phones, uh, phone cases will prevent your phones from breaking. I've been too busy to go do it. You know, I've been at your house. Yeah, the place is just a block down the street. Janet? Who else I found? I didn't know that. Yeah, the. Eric Brandt. Oh yeah. Everybody, everybody get a shot of this great line we got here. See how many people we're serving. It's really yeah. a good line this morning. Maybe because I made it. Probably what, 25 degrees out? Give or take. Something like that. Remember guys, steak what you're going to eat. Good turnout. My wife is amazing. She puts up with me when I want to go film. I haven't seen Guzman yet, Sasha. <laughs> Yo. Can you just help keep an eye on that phone? On the phone? Oh, yeah. What's up, man? I found the phone he speaks of. This is what happens when you're YouTubing sometimes. Oh. Liberty Freak. Oh, wait. Maybe not. We did get the truck fixed. <laughs> How's the cop blocklets? That's awesome, Rachel. Um, they're doing really good. Super happy. Always playing around. How are you guys doing this morning? Target acquired. Okay. Oh. There we go. Where is Pikes? Okay. Pikes check. Oh, Brian's got this. I'll go find Pikes and let him know. 
Sign mission achieved. Bad apples. Dun, 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 dun. Hey. Pikes. Hey. Are you muted? Yeah, I'm not anymore. Why? Oh, Are they someone, wondering what I'm doing? They were stressed on you. They were stressing on me? Yeah, they contacted me too and said, oh, he's offline already. <laughs> it's good to see you. Good, good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm good. Yes, uh, you know, I figured I'd come say hi. I'm glad you stopped by. I'm glad to be here. How are you? Good. It's good. I had to get some of That's why there was no sound. Muting. He muted it. That's what I'm talking about. Half the people that work can't survive. Get him He doesn't have a right to go to the senior sports it hurts less that way. That's funny. Yeah, actually, where is it? Well, pretty good turnout today, guys. I haven't seen Guzman yet. Have been published 
by the University of Texas through College of Law to examine these impacts. These reports, called too high a price and too high a price to move on to where have spent a quantified effort examining the impact of such laws in the state of Colorado. Two impacts which are discussed with best visitors here at Denver 16 Street Mall are the 23,000 children who are currently unhoused attending Denver Public Schools. 23,000 children. 23,000 children. And this has risen 300%. In the last I might have left my knife in my car. Another impact on side of the report Hi, Joyce. are the 288 people who died in the streets of Denver in 2018. Well, it's Maybe. We came to communicate our concerns many times. And when you told us you were going to pay off people due to our efforts, our efforts falling on blind eyes and hardened hearts. Our belief is that business With respect and to you, Oklahoma community watch. part of the discussion that occurs in a booming city such as it's the so Central Metro yeah. area where over 5,000 humans are going to sleep on the street in any given night. For months, How's everybody's morning going? However, other concerns exist. One story describes how a gentleman filled out your application for employment in response to the sign posted right outside this business. After completing the application, he was informed that hiring practices required the financial wealth of affording a cell phone in order to be qualified to wash dishes and help maintain. You coming down here, Ross? JD, a simple letter is not the spirit that we as a community at large would accept from any individual who had committed such actions as, say, an assault upon a class of individuals. In the justice system, we have established a process of reductive expectations which show the rehabilitative experience. Understanding how CBC restaurants is, as a community leader, showing such introspective insights would be a beneficial ingredient to our community discussion. We ask that you read the above report's name. Some people will and never get it, Rachel. You draft letter to the mayor stating your regrets for having helped an act Subscriber. and for enforcing policies which hurt the members of the Denver community in which I you haven't seen Regan yet. We've got Eric. We that this letter Cut the plastic. To the city of Denver. Pikes Peak is somewhere. Of the policies criminalizing homeless. We look forward to hearing Oh, that's Pike's Peak. Come down here and smoke. Yeah, whoever that was, come down here and smoke. <laughs> sm I'm like, whoever that was, I'm like, yeah, doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Come down here. We're a team player, and then we've got somewhere is Liberty Freak. I don't know where he is because he was running around on his phone, on his cellular device. I got a couple in the United. 
All right, well, let's go because we're filming today. We were complicit in these legislative efforts to eliminate panhandling. He's trying to find out who she's with. Additionally, we recognize that accurate analytical studies have determined that the Denver sick and live ordinances, as well as those being modeled after it, have caused serious implications. Oh my goodness. No, it could be. Uh, Fox interviewed Brian. And have affected I, communities citywide. I'm, I'm, I'm lending them my vocal. This I don't, includes I don't millions of, of dollars a year I, I've helped, in resources. This is, we need to come so together and out and coordinate to move along. Them all. It's Threaten the partnership from the head down. Threaten the whole, it's possible to do. It's I don't know how to do it. Instead of going after the solution, the way Janet has done, right. Janet's campus, efforts worthy of the art factor. How are they not? They're not about getting the kids because the park, because the because the community the the remains the fully in place. That's why six years have gone by without attacking right. the partnership and its policies. Oh, well, I, think, I think that partnership should be attacked. Well, attack well, attack I'm saying policy. here's how to do it. Here's how to do it. I don't know how. I'm saying it's very fucking simple. You, you. Put together an effort that actually threatens their pocket. Jamie is quoted as saying something about this threatening his business on Sunday mornings at the corner bank. We can do way the fuck out. out. We have a coordinated effort online, a petition, a a a a business. We have been so out of touch with these issues that we have internally applied the provisions of the urban camping ban to our own hiring practices. Now the corporation that has demanded publicly the same rights as human beings, we repent of all behavior that has inflicted uncountable damage to the gender community. We recognize that our efforts become a large corporation who have acted without concern to those who we depend on, trusted upon, as our own employees. I'm not saying the 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 I, this is the way. This is the way. Not being able to be a profit margin of real estate investment corporation. Now humbly submit to the public record that our own intentional actions are reprehensible and that we must break away from our past behaviors. It is why we call upon the city of Denver and the member of businesses that now compose the downtown Denver Business Improvement District. That'll be Regan. Join us and immediately. So now Regan is down here. By, by focusing on social responsibility that allows all of our workers to be just up. a right to rest and dignity for all, CBC restaurants hopes to redeem itself on its participation in the criminal. Legislation and help push through. We earnestly recognize the damages our actions have taken, and we call on Denver businesses to join us in pushing for the reversal of these inhumane, of these inhumane policies with the sunglasses that got us enacted. Sincerely. Frank T. Posse, Chief Executive Officer of CBC awesome, Restaurant Megan. Corporation, and Jamie Cutter, State Franchisee, Corner Bakery Restaurant. Will they sign it? Will they sign this letter? Will they sign this letter? We will find out soon, folks. Fox 31 has record that they want to come to the table. Will they renege again? Or will they hold to their word? 
We no kids, no wife today. I left them at home. Wherefore, too, I could do some stuff down here. I haven't seen any chalk action going on yet. Well, this wasn't, this wasn't about that. I know. I know. I was letting my ball work. You were running over there. It's nice to play with your chest. Meeting a lot of people this morning. It's really awesome. <laughs> I see how it is, Sasha. I'm not your favorite. Just joking. received a ten dollar donation from Jane. Jane, thank you so much. Family appreciates you. I appreciate the support for the channel. You're awesome. Shock machine would be awesome too. The roach? Who does? They found before the hell inspector found it. He said that I photoshopped that roach into there, but I didn't. Really? No. It was really. Alright, Ross, that's what's up. I'll be down here. Yeah, I have the original footage. And this is Eric and his occupier. Sweatshirt here. Dun, 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 dun. I'm very lucky. My wife has always supported me in any of the stupid stuff I want to do. right here that you can give them consent sure if you give them consent. and that they can get a search warrant uh -huh. or they can get a subpoena yes yeah it says right there shall not seize the you're talking about i'm sorry joseph joseph bonder yes uh -huh. I, I only know him as j bonder because that's yeah. always said well it's joseph bonder and you can absolutely tell him that eric grant says hello thank you so much <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the support, Cindy. Your, uh, Cindy. Uh, Sorry. What to against I try to make it at least entertaining for you guys. My wife really is what makes all of everything that I do possible. All the support that I get for you guys. Thank you. 
How long before they failed their inspection did you find that roach? Uh, I found that roach. I recorded the, the, that video that has the roach in it on October 1st. And then when did they get the failed inspection? Uh, it says here, according, so here you've got this. This will take you to this article on Fox 31 News. And it says right here, eight Serious code violations in 2000, December 2018. Okay. Eight. 2018. Yeah. December 2018. Eric is the road finder. Yes, sir. So, what I've got here for you guys is kind of a little different. bit of the story, right? Mm -hmm. We had nothing to do with the failed yeah. health code. That's a real thing. How's it going, man? I need you to get a good shot of that guy's face. This guy or that guy? No, the guy that's sitting in the window. There's no free coffee inside. There was, or no, there's no free coffee inside. We did free coffee. He usually stands out there. So, uh, sometimes are you done with your plate? Okay, there's a sports thing that you can do. You move. How about you go walk around somewhere else? Don't talk to me. Fucking asshole. I know if you get too close to my people and you we have you won't like it. <laughs> so the guy that was sitting at that table his name is Steve. And he actually works for the pavilion. Just when I thought it wasn't going to get any more stupid. Don't you fucking cough on me, you piece of shit. There's some spit that came out when he coughed on you, yeah, huh? I know that's there assault, was. right? It's all on video, too. That's assault, right? Yep, that's assault when you spit on someone, you piece of shit. Fuck you! I think this is a game, dude. Ken is trying to make nice, and this guy wants to be a piece of shit. What's up, what's up, what's up? up Wanna say what's up? You're on 303 Cop Block. There you go. So we can presume that he's calling the cops, right? All right. So he, he spit can... on you, and yep. then he's going to call the cops and have you arrested. Right? That'd be stupid. It was, I, I had a feeling that he was here. part of the Corner Bay Creek clan. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Right, right. <laughs> so really, we're, we're here. Trust me. I look innocent, and uh, I'm not. 
<laughs> that I was on have, film. I it was on okay. film. Okay, I have to keep the oh, ass on. Guys, let me get out. <laughs> You're funny, bro. Pikes be getting it with him. He's the man. We've got some indication that, uh, hey, oh, Genji. Eric, Eric is also the man. Where, what? We've got some indication that the cops are hanging out in the wings. Mm hmm. Oh, is that right? Yeah. So he spit on you? He coughed. And uh, 303 said the spit went on me on his video. Can you see it? I saw so it came out. I don't know if the video the caught it. Drive back your assailant. Is that right? Yeah. yeah. That's what I thought. Yeah. And he stepped all over our sign over there. That's what pissed me off the most. Oh, did he? This guy? Oh, sign? oh so being homeless is not a oh, crime. Oh, that guy stomped all over that sign? Oh, uh, uh, nope. The cockroach sign. You're right. Wow, you wore tennis shoes. Yeah, today I'm like, it's too cold out. It's a high bar. Eric in shoes. Is he going to call the police on you guys or what? I don't know, he might. Who? The guy that works there? The guy with the big beard? I don't know. What did he say? Did I tell you guys to leave? Uh, no, he just we doesn't like what... nothing to do with the failed health code inspections at the corner right. bakery. We know. All right. Or Box they should. 31 News, right there. A serious health code violation in the month of December alone. There he is. This guy. You work for the pavilion? You work for the corner bakery? You work for the police? <laughs> this guy is full of cockroaches and rat shit. <laughs> I didn't put any of those cockroaches or rat shit in there. They did that all by themselves. I've never been in them doors. That's awesome. So what's up, man? He's clever. I don't. He's recording us. What? Why are you walking up on people all weird like? Me? No, not you. Oh, this gentleman, yes. He, he, he told me earlier that he's an American. He doesn't support us assholes. Yeah, and no I'm good American shit. harassing folks for trying to go eat breakfast. I'm not harassing anybody. This is a public oh, service. Oh, I'm threatening you violently. Oh, yeah? You when are, you right? coughed and spit on me? I yeah. Didn't spit on yeah, you. I coughed because you got in my uh, fucking uh, face. Uh, I didn't hear uh, your face. Uh, you get uh, out uh, by my people and I'll go wherever I want. Well, not to be rude, sir. Do you realize you walk behind the DJ with a serious food? Way over here, behind this table. Fuck you. Public is y'all around. Exactly, sir. No, that's actually private property, which is why you didn't see me. Were you ever in the military? I'm not answering your question. So what? Like you are? Are? Yeah. That would be the fifth of the person I killed. So like, we're we're trying to have a good conversation with you. Okay. But I mean, you don't seem to be want to be receptive, except for to want to like walk up in people's space and make them a little. Sketchy. I, I'm just standing here just like anybody else, man. I, uh, okay. I have the same kind of right idea, man. Oh, really? Would you like a baby? No, thank you. I appreciate it. Glorious beard cam back. That's what we're going to call it. Is it going to come on this side? Separation. Obviously, he hasn't talked to the owners about what's going on. Well, he's been in and out of that restaurant a few times. Oh, I know he has. Yeah. He's just a concerned citizen, though. Oh, yeah. He's just a, That's what he wants you to think. He's just not expressing his views in public.
pig or someone equally jocking the pig. Okay. What's up, bro? What's up, man? Liberty Freak TV. Liberty What's up, everybody? Here we go. The cold shower really changed my mind. I said I did the energy. <laughs> he looks homeless. That's funny. Yeah. yeah, Liberty's here. Doing his thing. He's over here. Liberty. Three again. It's not just. Okay. okay. Um, so I'm probably going to go ahead and shut this off for a minute. Go see if I can get something, find something to get into. Everybody, be safe. I'll be right back. I'm sure we'll go find something to film. All right.